Are you wondering what's the best budget laptop for this year? If so, stay tuned, because by the end of this short video, you'll know exactly which one to choose. This list was made based on our personal views and are listed based on price, quality, durability, and more. To see prices and get more info about the product shown, be sure to check out the descriptions below. One last thing before we dive in, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell to get the latest product reviews from the channel. Okay, so let's get started with today's video. At number 5 is the Acer Aspire E15 laptop. The Acer Aspire E15 laptop is an excellent mix of new components, simple design, and handy features that have disappeared from other laptops, with battery life and performance that are excellent for its class. Design-wise, Acer Aspire's E15 series has maintained a steady design for the past two years. The body is made of plastic, other than brushed patterns on the lid and keyboard deck that adds style to an otherwise plain theme. It measures 15 by 10.2 by 1.2 inches and weighs 5.3 pounds. You can easily fit it into a backpack for college or the office. There's a pair of audible speakers that can fill a medium room and a 1280 by 720 pixels HDR webcam for Skype or video chats with family and friends. As for performance with an 8-gen Intel Core i5-8250U CPU, 8GB system memory, and 256GB SSD, the Acer Aspire E15 has enough power for day-to-day -day multitasking. This configuration is enough to keep multiple Chrome tabs open and enjoy between 1080p movie without slowing down the machine. In addition, instead of a 4K resolution touchscreen, you'll find a perfectly suitable 15.6-inch Full HD display. It's a great screen overall with pleasing color and way better off-angle viewing than you'll typically see at this price. The system's dedicated NVIDIA GeForce MX150 2-gigabit graphics card allows for modest gaming, though not as smooth as you'd get in a GTX 1050 equipped system. Moving on, the keyboard and precision touchpad is better than expected for the money too. Acer squeezed on a full number pad, and the typing experience is great. The keys are backlit, with the touchpad being smooth and responsive without being jumpy. Additionally, connectivity is excellent. On the left is a DVD-RW drive, a USB 2.0 port, while an SD memory reader rests on the front left corner. Others include an Ethernet port, VGA and HDMI ports, extending the display to larger screens like HDTVs, projectors, dual USB 3.0 ports, and a single USB Type-C port all on the left. A word on the battery. The Aspire E15 and its 62-watt-hour battery ran for over 10.5 hours, which is not bad at all, and a sign that you can safely leave the charger at home for the day. Overall, there are some cheaper options, but if you're looking for a system that sweetly balances value and feature set, the Acer Aspire E15 laptop is a great choice. At number 4 is the Lenovo Flex 14 2-in-1 Convertible Laptop. The Lenovo Flex 14 is inexpensive for a 4th Gen Core i5 laptop with a good keyboard and touchpad and excellent battery life. The 300-degree hinge gives you a second kiosk mode if you want. From a design aspect, the Flex 14 has a polished aluminum surface that gives the laptop a sleek premium look, while the flexible hinge is still sturdy enough to prop the device quickly into several positions. Weighing in at 3.5 pounds, the laptop is easy enough to carry around. Inside, the chiclet keyboard is robust and comfortable to type on, and both touchpad and touchscreen were responsive to use. Plus, it has a fingerprint reader that sits discreetly just below the bottom right of the keyboard, making it simple to get back into Windows with just a quick swipe. Moving on to performance, the Flex 14 has a variety of configurations available, starting from 7th Gen Intel i3 processors up to the latest 8th Gen i7 models. The 14-inch display comes in both HD, 1366 by 768, and FHD, 1920 by 1080 variants, with either Intel integrated or dedicated NVIDIA GeForce MX130 graphics. RAM goes up to 16GB, with storage sitting in at a max of 512GB. With regards to connectivity, you've got full-size ports for HDMI, two USB 3.0, one USB-C, and a card reader. In addition, Lenovo's also thrown in support for its Active Pen 2 stylus. When combined with Windows Inc., this turns the Flex 14 into a potentially significant device for design users or students to sketch on, which we liked. For your information, the battery life for the Flex 14 is set to sit firmly at around 10 hours, 
though this will vary greatly depending on your configuration and usage. Thankfully, you can quickly squeeze in two additional hours of usage from a dwindling battery in just 15 minutes of charging, with the optional fast-charging 64-watt power adapter. To conclude, the Lenovo Flex 14 is a robust offering for those who don't necessarily have the budget to splash on a higher-priced model, but still require a dependable 2-in-1 laptop that quickly delivers on both portability and performance. And we don't think you will be disappointed. At number 3 is the Asus VivoBook F510UA laptop. With the latest specs, impressive performance, and gorgeous looks, the Asus VivoBook F510UA is a beautiful laptop in the budget arena. From a design viewpoint, the F510 comes with a brushed metal shiny chassis in a glittery gray color. The laptop is thicker at the hinge edge and gradually gets narrower and weighs just 3.7 pounds, plus has an amazingly thin profile and is sleek to use. In addition, another unique aspect of this laptop is that it comes with an ultra-narrow 0.3-inch nano-edge bezel that gives an incredible 80% screen-to-body ratio. Thanks to this, the F510 makes it feel like you have a full 15.6-inch wide-view display embedded into a 14-inch display, which makes it compact. The VivoBook F510 is powered by an Intel Core i5-8250U processor with 8GB DDR4 RAM and Intel UHD 620 graphics. The display is Full HD display with a resolution of 1920 by 1080 pixels. As for performance, the VivoBook F510 performs pretty well and can manage everyday tasks without any issues. From MS Office, internet browsing with multiple Chrome tabs open to some casual games, it will handle all the tasks without any issues. Moving on, the touchpad is of average size, and it doesn't have any dedicated button. It is accurate while navigating the pointer, and the gesture controls work flawlessly on the touchpad, which is a good thing, and the palm rejection works well on the touchpad. The ergonomic chiclet keyboard feels comfortable to use and has a fingerprint sensor that adds a layer of security to the device. The speakers on the Asus VivoBook F510 are pretty loud, and the sound is crisp and clear while watching movies. For your information, the Asus VivoBook F510 comes equipped with a USB 3.1 Gen 1 port with reversible USB Type-C connector with an anyway-up design that makes connecting devices simple and quick. Plus, with lightning-fast 802.11ac Wi-Fi, keeps you connected through any congestion or interference. To conclude, if you need a premium-looking 15-inch Ultrabook with a great display, excellent audio, right keyboard at a budget price, then the Asus VivoBook F510 is the right choice, and we promise you won't be disappointed. At number 2 is the Samsung Chromebook Pro. If you're looking for a decent all-around laptop on a budget, the new Samsung Chromebook Pro should be near the top of your list. It's clear Samsung's design for the Chromebook Pro centers around portability. Weighing in at a scant 2.38 pounds, this all-black Chromebook is the lightest device in its class and featherweight compared to most laptops. The all-aluminum build makes it sturdy and flex-free with all-rounded edges and a softer metal that feels much more inviting to hold for long stretches than most hybrid notebooks. As for performance, the Chromebook Pro has a 12.3-inch 2400 by 1600 display with 360-degree rotating touchscreen and Intel Core M3 processor 2.2 GHz speed. With 4 GB LPDDR3 memory and 32 GB of eMMC storage, that's more than enough performance for multitasking. The Samsung Chromebook Pro adapts to whatever you're doing. Use it like a laptop to work or email. When you need a break, flip the screen so you can play games or read your book. Moving on, make your ideas personal and your notes clear with the built-in pen. Whether you're doodling, sketching, or personalizing a photo, the built-in pen will help you get every detail just right. You can even use the pen to take a screenshot, magnify, or unlock the screen. Additionally, there's a USB-C port on each side of the system, with headphones and a micro SD slot tucked away on the left side to go with a 3.5mm headphone jack. While this may seem limiting to a lot of users, one or two Type-C ports are quickly becoming the standard for compact lightweight systems. We got upwards of 6 hours on the battery before having to charge it, which is not too bad for a laptop on the go. To conclude, the Chromebook Pro looks great, has a beautiful screen, and enough power to do just about whatever you need, and one that would be a great budget choice. 
At number one is the ASUS C302CA DHM4 Chromebook Flip. The ASUS Chromebook Flip is priced to compete with entry-level Windows laptops, yet has a look and feel of a premium offering and is a very attractive alternative to yet another plastic laptop. Design-wise, the aluminum Chromebook Flip C302CA looks and feels like a MacBook, so it might fool anyone who doesn't see the big ASUS logo on the 2-in-1's lid and bezel. It's lightweight and weighs 2.6 pounds, measuring 0.6 inches thick. The 360-degree hinge feels stable and makes it easy to transition the bend-back convertible among laptop, stand, tablet, and 10 modes. Moreover, the 12.5-inch Full HD touchscreen is a highlight. It displays bright, sharp images with a wide-angle view you can share with a few close friends. The touch sensitivity is quick and fast enough for most web games. As for performance, the 4GB of RAM and 64GB of eMMC flash storage in the Chromebook Flip are respectively 2 and 4 times as much as you'll get in most Chromebooks at the same cost. In addition, it starts in seconds and will last all day. The Chromebook Flip C302 is designed to run for up to 10 hours on a single charge. Just open your flip and get right to work or play without having to wait. It boots up with a super fast time of 3.5 seconds. Moving on, typing is now more comfortable than ever with the full-size one-piece chiclet keyboard. With an improved back assembly which provides 1.4mm of key travel and minimal key float. So, you get a more solid typing feel. Additionally, the stereo speakers on the left and right side panels can fill a small to medium-sized room with clear 87 decibel of high-fidelity audio. The Chromebook Flip features two USB-C ports for super simplicity and fast transfer speeds of up to 5 gigabyte per second while maintaining complete backward compatibility. The micro SD card slot allows you to conveniently upload photos, videos, or other files to the device. To conclude, the Asus Chromebook Flip C302 is worthy of its premium stature with a gorgeous screen, tactile keyboard, and classy design that's equally as comfortable to use in tablet mode or as a traditional laptop. And that's why it tops our list. Thanks for watching the video. We hope you found it useful. Be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel to get more videos like this in the future. If you do have any questions related to these products, you can leave a comment below and we will get back to you. Catch you soon.